Oh. Due to the number of abortions you've had, it's highly unlikely that you'll be able to have children again. Even if you do, there's a high probability of habitual miscarriages. Besides, your organs have already begun to fail. Please prepare for the worst. So pitiful. So young and already suffering from organ failure. Currently in our country, there's no technology available to treat this. Her current state is all her own doing. How many times has it been this year? The fourth time. Even if she's not a prostitute, she shouldn't be this reckless. Exactly. What kind of vicious and cheap woman could heartlessly abort four children in a year? Sitchin, don't! That's our child! Don't do it! Don't, Sitchin! I'm begging you, don't take away my child again! I've already had three abortions! This might be my only child in this lifetime, please! I'm begging you! Chow Ran. Chow Ran. You really are Chow Shang Kang's good daughter. A year ago, he used the Lee's family and the project to force me to marry you. He even drugged me on our wedding night. Now you're desperately trying to use a child to tie me down? Dream on. I didn't do it. My dad couldn't possibly do such a thing. You better understand your place. You're nothing more than a tool for desire to vent. You have no right to bear my child. Forget about it. If you take away this child, I might really die. Don't play tricks in front of me. Pretending to be pitiful. Who are you performing for? I'm tired of these antics. Someone drag her away. No, don't! Ran Ran. Please beg Sichuan to spare the child's family. After all, you and he were husband and wife for four years. There must be some feelings left. But I... I really has no other choice. Otherwise, I wouldn't ask you to beg him. Ran Ran. Help your father. The child family can't be ruined by my hands. I understand. Miss Chow, get in the car. I want to see Lisa Chen. You better not cause trouble. President Lee is busy and has no time to see you. If you don't take me to see Lisa Chen, I'll die right here. Miss Chow, it's been a year. You still haven't accepted reality. Even if you die here a hundred times, what can it change? President Lee won't even glance at you. Get in the car. Hasn't he always wanted a divorce? Tell him for me, I agree. To the divorce. A year ago, my father said you wanted to marry me. I was so happy then. I thought you liked me. But it turns out... Who agreed to your divorce? Don't you know that now our family has a special situation? Moreover, you carry in the future hair of the Lee's family. You aborted it? You couldn't even keep a child? If it was a child, the Lee's family, our family wouldn't have ended up in this situation. Dad, you came over. Why didn't you say something? My dear son-in-law, I'm begging you. Please have mercy on our family and give us a way to live. You want me to spare the child's family? Okay. There's a party tonight with Mr. Duan. As long as she agrees to accompany Mr. Duan to get the South City project for me, I'll agree. No, Su Chen. See? It's your dear daughter who disagrees. Not me. Ran Ran. Dad is begging you. Please agree. Dad! You actually want me to accompany Duan Yu Chen? In the whole of City, everyone knows whoever went into his bed either ends up dead or hurt. How could you? Isn't there any other way? If Chow Corporation fail, it's not just about our family's life and death. Ran Ran, that is begging you. Our family can't be ruined in my hands. Have you decided? Ran Ran, you really want me to kneel and beg you? Fine, I'll go. I must say President Lee really knows how to choose people. Actually, what do you want has never been just some project, right? To torment me? Or do you want my life? President Lee, you can just say it. I'll give you what you want. No need to go through all this. President Lee, you're here. And this is? Of course she's here. To accompany President Duan for drinks. Such a beauty. President Lee, you're willing to give her away? There's nothing I'm not willing to do.
Let go of me. Please, I beg you, President. Since you're here to drink with me, then this drink is for you. I really can't drink. I beg you, please. President Lee. Just drinking is so boring. I see President Duan also bought some more. Why don't we play something else? President Lee is always thoughtful. Let's play dice then. Whoever loses, their female companion has to remove part of the clothing. How about it? No, Lee Sutton, please no. Okay. What a pity. Ha <laughs> President Lee really gets it. No, Lisa Chen, please no, please no. I'm begging you. Miss Chow, can't you take a joke? Or do you want to embarrass me? Just now, President Duan's companion already removed one. But that was just her outer garment. Why isn't the beauty undressing yet? Wasn't it your own choice to come here, didn't you? Why are you being so pretentious now? All right. Lisa Chen, must you really humiliate me like this? President Duan, please forgive me. It seems I haven't trained well enough. How about we punish her today by making her kneel here and reflect on her actions? I'll follow President Lee's lead. President Duan has decided you better kneel quickly. I was meddling too much right now. Disturbing Miss Chow's mood, indeed. Being so cheap, she might even enjoy stripping in public. Charen, wake up! Charen! Sichen. I might never be able to get pregnant again in my life. You don't think I would sympathize with you, do you? Charan. I advise you save your energy. If you really want to please me, you should have died on the operating table today. Save me the trouble. You can't even accompany a drink from me. So... You hate me that much? Now that you've understood, Sign the papers quickly. After we separate, will you marry Shen Keiyan? Asking knowingly? I can sign. But you must agree to one condition. Chao Ren. You think you can negotiate terms with me? Si Chen. I can leave without taking anything. I don't want anything. I only ask you to give the Tiao's family a chance to survive. Now you think of begging me? Chao Ren, when your father threatened to marry you off for a business deal, didn't he ever think there would be a day like today? All of this is just a consequence of your own actions. Fine. As long as you continue to suppress the Tao's family, I will never agree to divorce. As long as I don't divorce, Shen Keiyuan won't have a chance to marry into the Li's family. Even if she comes back to the country, she can only be a mistress in the shadows. Threatening me? Yes, I'm threatening you. Didn't you choose a secret marriage just to keep her from knowing about me? Imagine when she comes back. And finds out you married another woman behind her back. What will be her reaction? I dare. Lee Sichen, I'm not asking for much. I just want you to spare the Tao's family. I will willingly divorce. I'm really begging you. What if I say that I will only spare the Chao family if you die? Lee Sichen. Fine. I agree to your terms. I have no interest in taking your worthless life. I can promise you to temporarily spare the Charles family. But as soon as Kei Yuan learns about your existence, 
you know the consequences. I'll sign the papers right now. If a suitable match isn't found, how long can I live? Can I be selfish one last time? What? Now you can't bear to give up the position of Mrs. Lee? Lisa Chen, from the beginning to the end, did you ever like me? Even for a moment? Chora, must you humiliate yourself like this? Sichen, I have one last thing to ask of you. Speak. Can you, for the sake of our past, stay with me for a few more days? When Shen Ke Yuan returns, we'll go our separate ways. I'll never appear in front of you again. Is that okay? Chara, you better not overstep. Kiwa, what's up? Can I call you without a reason? Have you missed me? I should be able to return to the country next week. Are you happy? Lisa Chen, call an ambulance. Si Chen, what's happening there? It sounded like someone was calling you. I'm still at the office working overtime. A colleague just came over to ask me something. I'll get back to you after I'm done. Lisa Chen. Ciao, Ram. Every time after an abortion, you have to put on an act. Is it fun? Choran! Choran! Someone call an ambulance! Quick! Miss Chow, because you didn't properly recuperate after the surgery, you fainted due to severe bleeding. Although we saved you in time, you won't be able to have children anymore. Well, I don't deserve to be a mother anyway. Where's Lisa Chen? He's already left. All right. Your condition is currently worsening. We recommend you to be hospitalized immediately. Thank you. I know my own body. Please help me with a hospital admission. Hey, are you out of your mind? How can you get out of bed now? Even if you really do that kind of work, you shouldn't treat your body so badly. Miss? Are you alone? Do you need me to hail a cab for you? Or join you for a drink? Do you love me? What? If you kiss me with love, I'll go with you. Chalvin, since when did you become so cheap? I don't need you to care! Who are you? Get lost now! Are you that desperate for a man? The daughter of the Chow's family is now on the street? Randomly asking for a kiss from a stranger? Yes, I am desperately longing for a man. So what? We've already divorced. If you don't want to accompany me, there are plenty who will. People like you should just go sell themselves in bars. Yes, I don't even need to take precautions. Since I can't get pregnant anymore. I... Lisa Chen, I'm asking you one last time. Are you willing to accompany me for a few more days? Just five days. Otherwise, I will go and tell your beloved Miss Shen. Then not only did I marry you, but I also carried your child four times. Charan, don't push my limits. Lisa Chen, you love Shen Ke Yuan so much, right? Give me a few days and I will disappear forever from your world. It's a good deal for you. You don't want Shen Ke Yuan to know you betrayed her, do you? 
three days at most. Good. That's enough. But I ask you to treat me like you treat Shen Ke Yuan. Can you do that? You don't deserve it. I'll try to be nice to you. Don't expect anything else. Okay. In three days, at this time, I will go with you to the Civil Affairs Bureau to process the divorce. Then I'll disappear. Now, accompany me to see a movie. Fuya, I'm not working these three days. You go and arrange the work. Lisa Chen, actually, I'm about to die. I'm frozen. Get in the car. Six years for three days, Tao Ren. You've made a big gain. Where are they now? At the cinema. I've already transferred the money to you. I'll distract the Chen later. Remember, handle it cleanly. Tao Ren, since you've blocked my path to become Mrs. Lee, I have no choice but to send you to death. Give me a bucket of popcorn. I won't caramel popcorn. Right. What were you saying just now? Nothing. So sickening. Sichan, so guess where I am now? At school. I've come back to the country early. I'm at the airport right now. Will you come to pick me up? Okay. I'll come to get you. Please, Sichen, I'm begging you. Don't go. Didn't you promise me to stay with me for these three days? Please, I'm begging you. Don't leave. Chow, don't I'm... leave. Remember your status. Extra three days? You're just out of pity. Now she's back. It's time for you to go. You can use the card as you like these few days. Get the hell away from me. This is not what I want. Lisa Chen, if you leave now, I'll die in front of you. Play such a trick again. Do you think I really care about your life or death? If you want to die, be quick. Don't get in my way. It all comes from retribution. After all, a person like me shouldn't continue living in this world. Lisa Chen, Charan. goodbye. My babies, I'm coming to atone for my sins. Charan! Charan! President Lee, she couldn't get through to your phone. Cut you in. Sorry. I clearly said today that I'll come to pick you up. Picking me up is a small matter, but I've been trying to contact you and was really worried. There was a minor incident on the way to the airport. It's all sorted now. Are you okay? Where are you now? I'll come to find you. I'm fine now. Are you still at the airport? I'll send the car to take you home. I was afraid that if you came, you'd miss me. So I've been waiting for you at the airport. But it's okay. I can get back on my own. Take care of yourself there. I'll come to see you tomorrow. Later, I'll surely make it up to you. Xiao Ran, let's see what you can do against me. Su Chen. Awake? You have been watching over me? Don't flatter yourself. I'm only here to remind you that KUN has returned to the country. Some people should know their place, disappear on their own. Chao Ran, remember your promise. Otherwise, I won't spare the Chao's family. I understand. By the way, I lied about being in a car accident in the next ward. She'll come to the hospital to see me tomorrow. I don't care how you do it, don't let her see you.
What am I still hoping for? After all, the one he treasures has returned. What am I compared to her? Money, money, money. Where do I have money now? My family is always ruined by Lisa Chen. Beast! What's the use of you being nice to me without money? Initially, it wasn't me who asked Xiao Ran, that damn girl, to marry Lisa Chen. Dad? Auntie? I'm back. Why, why, why are you back? Did Lisa Chen come back with you? Dad, we got divorced. But don't worry, he has already agreed. Waste. How could you divorce him? It's such a big matter. Why didn't you discuss it with me beforehand? Now in the capital, which family's assets can compare to the Lee's family? Isn't it just about losing a few children? How could you just divorce? But how much money did you get from the divorce? I left with nothing. Divorce and left with nothing? How could I have given birth to such a fool? Go back and remarry him now. Even you have to kneel and beg. This marriage cannot end. You left with nothing. How is that possible? Let me tell you, all this money belongs to the Chow's family. If it weren't for you, how could the Chow's family have ended up like this? I won't beg him anymore. Fine. Then get out right now. My family has no daughter like you. Hello, who is this? Sorry, he's not available to take the call right now. There's no note here either. What's your name? I can pass on the message for you. Shoan Road Garden, villa number 120. There's a patient by the street who needs immediate emergency care. Okay, Dr. Shen. Why is it her? Do you know her? Her name is Chao Ren. No one in our department doesn't know her. She's had four abortions. Four times? Was there a man who accompanied her? No one came with her. We all guess that she must be involved in that kind of work. Otherwise, why would she have four abortions in a year? And even developed organ failure syndrome. Chao Ren? I told you not to contact me proactively. Hello? I'm Dr. Shen Yanshang from the city center's internal medicine department. May I ask if you know Miss Chao Ren? Not well. What's the matter? Miss Chow is suffering from severe organ failure and is currently being treated in the hospital. You were the last person she contacted, so I wanted to ask you if you could come to the hospital. Organ failure? How much did Chow pay you for telling me such a ridiculous lie? Sir, I have no reason to deceive you. She's currently at the hospital. Enough. Tell Chow to stop playing such tricks in front of me. If she really wants to die, then let her die. Push her into the operating room. Her condition is critical. We must operate immediately. I'll take responsibility if anything goes wrong. What's wrong? Why are you crying? Yesterday when I went to your house, I was photographed by reporters. I've just entered the entertainment industry and barely gained some fame. What should I do now? Don't worry. I will handle this matter. There, there are even rumors online that you got married. I'm the third party who ruined your marriage. Even though we've been together for seven years. When will you marry me? 
I will clarify all this for you. As for the wedding day, how about in a week? What do you think? Really? Shichen, I love you so much. I just don't know if Miss Shen is willing to skip the engagement and marry me directly. Yes, I'm willing. Looks like I need to start a crash diet soon. Then I'll leave first. Do you remember my favorite color? Pink. I knew you loved me the most. I won't disturb your work then. Okay. My smear campaign can stop now, but keep the news hot until Lee's family makes a statement. Good job this time. The price is doubled. How long have I slept? A day and a half. What? Lie down. I need to be discharged. I don't care if you're about to die this time, or have some other excuse. See you at the Civil Affairs Bureau entrance in 20 minutes. I'm at the hospital. Chao Ran, is this amusing? To avoid divorce, you really would do anything. Indeed. I'm just a woman who, to achieve her goal, would even joke about her own life. President Lee, you knew all along, didn't you? Don't worry, I'm heading to the Civil Affairs Bureau now. I won't delay your time. It better be so. Thank you, Dr. Shin, for saving me. But as you heard, I have to rush for a divorce. If you don't want to live, then you can leave now. Before dying, remember to pay the hospital and surgery fees. The word live seems quite luxurious for me right now. Oh, right. I heard from the nurse that my corpse is quite valuable for research. When I die, just donate it. Taran, did you see it? Before the divorce, he was already eager to announce to the whole world who his true love is. Lisa Chan, it's you. As expected, things just got more interesting. I saw the news. You got married so quickly. Don't you have anything to say to me? Chao Ran, I don't want you to attend my wedding with KUN. Don't call me anymore. As for your cheap tricks, next time I won't let you off easily. Wish you and Shin Ke Yun a happy marriage and a blissful family. Also, President Lee, don't forget the promise you made to me. As long as Xiao Shenkang doesn't cause trouble, I will spare the Chao's family. It seems that from the beginning, what you left me was always just a view of your back. Dr. Shen, why are you here? Looks like you've already settled your affairs. Now I have a deal to discuss with you. Get in the car. Puyang, check who the owner of this car is. Okay, President Lee. Su Chen. Does it look good? Even without a wedding, I'm still the most beautiful bride, right? I didn't mean that. I know. You're busy expanding your power to take back control of the Lee's family. But today is our wedding night. I really wanted to wear a wedding dress. 
What's wrong? Are you sick? Do you feel bad? I'll call the doctor and make you some sobering soup. Dad is the one to blame. He should have made you drink less. What are you doing, Sichen? Chao Shun Kang. Is this your new goal? Dad! Li Sichen is about to get married. It's been over a year, and you can't even keep a person. You even jeopardized the entire Chao's family. If it weren't for you, the company wouldn't be like this. No matter what you do, even if you have to kneel, bring Li Sichen back. I won't go find him again. But Dad, rest assured, he has already promised me not to take action against Chao's again. Do you think that just because he doesn't act, the Chao's family can survive? Ran Ran, I'm begging you. Chao's really can't be ruined in my hands. From a young age, you've been under Chao's protection. Now it's time for you to pull Chao's out of this. Only you can do this. Dad, stop pressuring me. It's completely over between him and me. Fine. If you'd rather see Charles destroyed than go of your pitiful pride, then Charles' family doesn't need you anymore. Dad! Shen Yansheng, I agree to your terms. I've already started to look forward to it. She once said she wanted a blue themed wedding. Most of the guests have arrived, President Lee. The wedding could start now. Okay. What happened to her? Organ failure? That was so long ago. Why are you telling me this now? President Lee, Ma Tung said he saw Miss Chow in Haiko. It seems like she's going to jump in the sea. What? President Lee, the wedding is about to start. Where are you going? Chow Ren can't die. Chow Ren. Ah! President Lee, I was under the area. Very dangerous. You can't do that. Let go. President Lee. This. In the end, I still disturbed your wedding, didn't I? You must be cursing me in your heart again. Chow Ren. Come down first. The place is dangerous. Don't come over. Li Chen, you stop. Chao Ren, listen to me. Come down. The tide is about to rise. Stop this nonsense. I'm begging you. I'm not lying. I really don't have much time left to live. Now I just ask you to keep your promise and spare my dad. Spare the Chao's family. I promise you. I agree to everything. I will find the best doctors to treat you. Not only the Chao's family. You will be fine too. Chao Ren, come down first. Lisa Chen, I used to really want to marry you, but now I don't want to anymore. Lisa Chen, I'm tired. I've had enough of this world. I can finally be free at last. Chara, don't do it. Come back and I'll marry you. Let me be selfish just this once. Don't do it. I know that as long as I live, what I'll ultimately face is your disgust. If I go first, will you always remember a girl named Chao Ran? Chao Ran! President Lee, the tide has already risen. You can't go there. Let go. Chao Ran is still down there. Go look for her. Immediately have someone search. President Lee, early this morning, all the boats were loaned out. Don't care. Use whatever means to find her. Rest assured, President Lee, I've already instructed them to call all the boats back. People at the dock can now sit out to search. But it's the sea down there. Miss Chao might... How could she possibly? How could she possibly? How possibly? How possibly? How possibly? President Lee! Don't! Sichen, don't! That's our child! Don't! Chao Ran. 
Goodbye, Lisa Chen. Chopra, don't. Chopra, President Lee, you're awake. Where is she? Rest assured, President Lee. The professional diving rescue team has been searching for three days. So far, there's no news of Miss Chow. They say she might have been swept away. I don't believe it. Keep searching. How could she possibly die? She clearly didn't choose to die in such a situation back then. President Lee. Yes, I'm on it. Even if she really, really is dead. I must see the person alive. I'll see the body in death. Yes. President Lee, the body was just discovered on the coast. According to DNA testing at the hospital, it's Miss Chow. Fuya. She's not dead, right? They must have made a mistake. Ran Ran, can I take you home? I'm afraid, President Lee, can't have your way. This is the body donation agreement, signed by Miss Chow, before her death. What if I insist on taking her with me? Then we'll have to meet in court. Excuse me, Mr. Lee, please make way. Since you dared to come to the hospital on your own, why didn't you stay longer? There's no need. Staying there longer might have exposed me. Now remember our agreement. I'll treat your illness my way. While your body is for my research, so your life is now mine. I don't allow any mishaps beyond research and treatment. Dr. Shin, it won't happen again! Tara and the scoundrel, even in death she's still entangled with Lisa Chen. Since it's like this, then I'll make your entire Tao's family accompany you down. We've known each other for so many years. Only photo we have together is just this one. Fuyang. Why am I so sad when she's gone? Shouldn't I be happy instead? President Lee, please accept my condolences. I've consulted a lawyer for you. Miss Chow's body indeed cannot be reclaimed through legal means. Aside from that, this afternoon the medical school personnel have already taken the body away. Now I'm afraid they will do with her what they do with bodies donated from research. Most of them are used for anatomical studies by medical students. If I bring her back, legal procedures won't work. To resort to illegal means, President Lee, please remain calm. President Lee. Miss Chen is downstairs now. What is she here for? Si Chen, what's been going on with you lately? You don't answer calls and no one can find you. Now the entire capital's laughing at us. If you don't want to marry me, you can just tell me. Why have you been dragging me along all these years? I'm sorry. I've neglected you recently. The wedding will take place in half a month. I wanted to surprise you, but it seems I've made you worry. Really? I knew it! You wouldn't leave me! Charles Corporation has incurred massive external debts. This morning, Charles Chen and Xiao Shengkang jumped off a building and committed suicide. What? Don't move recklessly. Your life is mine now. What? You want to go find him? And what, after you meet him? Question him? Or use your fragile body to kill him? Stay calm, Chora. You can't do anything now. In the end, Lisa Chen still hasn't let go of the Tiao's family. Lisa Chen and Shen Keiyuan's wedding has been postponed for half a month. I happen to have two invitations. Do you want to go? Can I go? 
Of course you can. Just be careful not to let anyone see your face. You can also visit your father's grave. Thank you. You're welcome. I only care about your life, not you. Don't forget the condition you agreed to. Dr. Shin is worried that if I die, you won't be able to study my body properly, right? You can rest assured, I've made my promise. I tell Run will never go back on it. You help me extend my life and I'll let you study. This deal won't leave me at a loss. Moreover, there are some grudges that I can only settle if I'm alive. As long as you understand. Mr. Lee, these are the things I found related to all the events that occurred in Chao Group before Chao Shenkang's final moments. The mastermind behind this seems to be Mr. Shen She Chen. Mr. Shen, Ke Yuan, is there any involvement of yours in this matter? Investigate further. Find out everything about the Shens and Chao's families over the years. Get me all the details. Chao's family is my final promise to her. I can't break it again. President Lee, will the wedding in three days? Proceed as planned. All right. Regret it now? I just feel how foolish I used to be. If it weren't for this love, how could I have ended up in this situation? Mr. Lee and Miss Shen are truly an outstanding couple. Especially Miss Shen's beauty. But why did I hear that Mr. Lee actually has a wife? That Miss Chow from the Chow's family. The Chow's family? Where is the Chow family now? Chow Shenkang's daughter can't be compared to Miss Shen. Fu Yang, I'm about to marry someone else. Do you think she'll get jealous? Or angry? Mr. President, Miss Chow already. Fu Yang, do you know? I'd rather she die with resentment and become a vengeful spirit to haunt me. Chow Ran! Mr. Lee, hello. It's you. I didn't expect Mr. Lee to remember me. Wishing you a happy wedding. Oh, regarding Miss Chow's matter, please accept my condolences. Where is she? Why did Mr. Lee suddenly ask me to find her? As for where is Miss Chow now? You should know better than I do, right? Or is it that Mr. Lee had an hallucination due to excessive longing? I happen to know an expert in this field. I can recommend to Mr. Lee. I just clearly saw her. I clearly just saw her. What's the matter, Mr. Lee? You want to resort to violence at your own wedding? Or is it that Mr. Lee realizes who is the true love only after she is dead? That would be a pity. She's already dead even dissected in front of everyone. What's the point of doing all this now? So Chen, this time, you can't abandon me because of work again. Miss Shen, hello. I am Miss Chao's attending physician. My name is Shen Yanshan. Miss Chao? It's nothing. Just an insignificant person. I'll take my leave. Chao Ren, what are you hoping for? You and him are just insignificant people. Isn't this something you've known for a long time? Is there anything worth being sad about? Sichen, why haven't you returned to the villa in Haicheng Bay? Isn't this our new home? And it's closer to the company. So are we spending... Sichen. Ran Ran. Please, Sichen. Sichen. Ran Ran. I suddenly remembered that there's still work at the company. Sichan!
Hello? You're calling me now? Tonight is your wedding night. Be more proactive. Seize the opportunity to have the Lee's family child. Sachin and I may be married now, but our actions to undermine the Lee's family must not stop. In fact, we need to speed up. What do you mean? Aren't you now Lee's wife? If you get pregnant, isn't all of this ours now? What are you worried about? Although I've married him, he still has someone else in his heart. Now he can pamper me, but in the future, this favoritism might go to someone else. Have you thought about the consequences if what we did in the past is exposed one day? But what we did before, you couldn't even find out. When Chalvin was alive, now. <laughs> She's dead. There's nothing to worry about. Shen Sichen, you need to wake up. Only by having Lee's family in your grasp can it be secure. What kind of medicine did you give to me? Just some homemade medicine. The dosage might be a bit strong, but you feel better after vomiting. Don't worry, you won't die. If you want to recover quickly, this is the way. Why haven't you woken up yet? You're just a pervert! I will resist. Resistance is futile. You have no human rights here. I remember you also used to do ballet. What's wrong? Your condition has improved now. Are you thinking about revenge? What do you mean? I remember that SR back then was established jointly by the Charles and the Lee families to help the Lees build for their first business. Do you know who's on the board of SR now? Who? Shen Ke Yuan. How can it be her? After the Charles family collapsed, most of the industries were taken over by the Shen family. I heard that Shen Ke Yuan won numerous domestic ballet awards. Since her childhood, she even obtained a scholarship for further studies with a foreign troupe after graduation. She's just a rat in a gutter, only able to perform thanks to her stolen reputation. Oh. Back then, if it weren't for marrying Lisa Chen, the person standing on stage now should be me. Lisa Chen, you moved the wedding date up by two months on purpose just to make me give up my ballet scholarship, right? I told you back then that you could only choose marriage or a ballet troupe. You gave up your dream yourself, can't blame me. So, after you forced me to give up, you had the opportunity to manipulate my scholarship and transfer to Shen Ke Yuan. Let her enjoy the honors I worked hard for over the years. She easily got opportunities which how many people dreamed of? Lisa Chen, is she worthy of it? Chao Ran, don't act all high and mighty in your judgment of me. If it weren't for you, we wouldn't have parted ways. This is your debt to her. Those things don't belong to her at all. I will report her and reclaim everything that's rightfully mine. Do you think the whole thing was solely my doing? Without your good father's help, none of this would have gone so smoothly. Once this matter is exposed, neither your father nor the Charles family can escape. If it weren't for Lisa Chen, in my life, would I haven't lost my own dreams? I happen to have an SR training spot available. Do you want it? I do. You need to think it through. The entertainment industry is not a clean place. And Shun Ke Yuan is a high-ranking member of SR. One word from her can decide life or death. Moreover, once you're in SR, Lee Sin Jin will eventually see you. And you'll know you're not dead. Have you thought about the consequences? Didn't you ask me earlier if I wanted revenge? I do. I want to take back everything that's rightfully mine. Besides, you can be my back. Do you want to watch a hard-earned life being ruined by someone else in the end? Don't overestimate yourself. I have all the data I need. I won't help you. If I'm not mistaken, you probably have a grudge against Lisa Chen, right? Otherwise, why go to such great lengths? Dr. Shen, I have no intentions of prying into your past. But now we have a common enemy. Why can't we join forces? If you think it through, go ahead. Relationship over there has already been cleared for you. This is your new identity. Use it well. Where did you come from? Fake. 
Enough of deceiving people. Don't be too ostentatious in the future. Remember to report to SR later. Am I going today? In the medicine just now, I prepared a painkiller for you. For the interview, it might be intense physical activity. Be careful. Your life is mine. Dr. Shin, no matter why you do this, thank you for helping me. I forgot to tell you something. If you want to regain SR, you must obtain a certain document. Good. Tell Ren. I will definitely make good use of this identity. How's the investigation go? Shen Shichen, that old fox, is longing for Lee's cooperation, using your trust and your fondness for Miss Shen to plant many people openly and secretly into the group. After you got married, he even participated in some of Lee's family projects. Do they all need to be cleared out? No harm done. If he wants to meddle, let him meddle. The real Lee's is not what he sees. On the surface, his influence can only reach where I want him to. For the Charles family, I want to recover it completely as it was. Let's start with SR. Honey, there's a department meeting at SR today. They've invited me to attend an observer. I may just be a nominal director for now, but I think I should make an appearance. Can you take me there? SR? Perfect time. I also have something to attend there. I'll escort you later. Thank you, honey. What's wrong? Honey, there's a talent audition for trainees this morning in the company. Do you want to come and see? Good. I have something to do later. I'll contact you after I'm done. You love me the most. That's Mission and President Lee, right? So sweet. Chao move aside. It's her. It must be. What's wrong with you, Sichen? Let go! Is it my illusion again? My foot seems to be twisted. Sorry for being a bit improper. Mr. Lee is so good to his wife. He even squats down in public to massage Miss Shen's feet. I heard they had a long distance relationship for several years before getting married. It's really admirable. So you too have such a gentle side. Four abortions couldn't win back a shred of your compassion. Well, she just shed a few tears. And it makes you feel this sorry for her. It's really ridiculous. Didn't the company say yesterday that I should be in charge of the doctor selection train? Yes, but didn't you already decline it? You told them I would participate. So why the sudden change of heart? I'm in a good mood today. Who's the idiotic jerk here? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I really didn't mean it. My mood was ruined early in the morning. And if I fail today's practice assessment, I'll blame it all on you. I really didn't mean it. You're also here for the assessment? Wearing a hat? Seems to be ugly and can't face people. It's a surprise. They look pretty good. Let me go. Let go of me. We're all here to participate in the assessment as trainees. Aren't you afraid I'll report you? Let go of me. Let go. We're all here to participate in the assessment as trainees. Aren't you afraid I'll report you? Stop struggling. My dad is a shareholder in this company. Who are you? Dare you interfere in my affairs? Lisa Chin. I, I apologize, Mr. Lee. We were just joking around. Wai Chuan? It's okay. You go ahead. I can handle this. President Shen, what do you want to see me for? 
I didn't expect to meet so soon. When did you return to the country? I've already finished shooting overseas. I just got back. Oh, by the way, I haven't had a chance to congratulate President Shen and President Lee on the wedding. Why, Chuan? Don't treat me like this. Whether it's back when I wanted to go abroad so badly or now that I've entered the entertainment industry, it's all because of you. I just want to see you more. I hope President Shen respects yourself. Don't put such a big hat on me. Regarding the rumors between you and President Lee, it can be clarified and the whole world knows about it. In addition, as for the rumors about me and President Shen, I hope they can be clarified soon as well. Otherwise, the G's family won't care about tearing the face with the Shen's family. Why, Chuan? You know that these rumors have already spread. It's really hard to control. Actually, it's not a big deal. At most, fans will ship us together, as long as we stay clear. That doesn't mean I don't know who's spreading the rumors. Since you're already married, I hope you can fulfill your duties as a wife. I'll tolerate you, only because Lee Sin Shin and I are childhood friends, and I've spared you some dignity. Good. I understand. The trainee selection is about to begin. Let's go in together. Shen Keiyun, so you never loved him in the first place. Hui Chuan, wait for me a little longer. Right now I can't confront the Li's family head on. But one day, I will have the Li's family in my grasp. By then, let's see how you escape from my grasp. Why is movie star Z out with President Shen? I told you the rumors were true. He has liked President Shen since they were in school. So jealous. Her husband is Lisa Chen and Z Huai Chuan still likes her. Fate can be so different. Tiao Ren? No, 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 that's not right. Tiao Ren is already dead. No, she's already dead. Hello everyone, I'm Shen Ke Yuan. Today as the main judge, along with movie star Z, the best actor, and the other teachers, we will collectively decide whether you can stay and become true as our trainees. Don't be nervous, everyone. Just show your true abilities. Why hasn't Lisa Chen arrived yet? He has a meeting. He'll come after the meeting. Lisa Chen has to come too? Monica, remember to briefly introduce the candidates to President Lee. After all, he is the CEO of SR. It can't be all left to me. Sure thing, President Shen. Isn't this a bit too indulgent? Just married and he sends her a company? Lisa Shen, to make her happy. SR was handed over like this by you. Hmm. All right, you can discuss who should go first. I'll go first. What's your name? Tianran. So, what's your talent? Ballet. This Tianran isn't a fool, is she? Dancing ballet in front of President Shen is truly overestimating herself. It's all just a coincidence. Besides, when she was alive, she wasn't worth fearing. What is there to fear now that she's dead? Just a lowly trainee. I could simply crush her. President Shen has won numerous awards from a young age. Especially her signature piece, Swan Lake which has even graced international stages. Are you sure I can offer you a chance to choose again? No need, I'll choose ballet. The Swan's Demise Hello, President Lee. For this selection, there are six candidates. There are Tian Ran. What did you just say? Chao Ren? Mr. Lee, it's not Xiao Ran, it's Tian Ran. It's her. It must be her. I didn't make a mistake. You've been given a chance. Since you insist on choosing ballet, then go ahead and demonstrate. Damn it, it's absolutely perfect. Wow, that was beautifully danced. Don't applaud. Didn't you see how upset President Shen is? This Tin Run must have made a fatal mistake in ballet we don't understand, so let's not get involved. To avoid leaving a bad impression on President Shen. What do you think, President Shen? She has a sense of beauty, but that's all. She's also very talented, but I think you may not be suitable to be a trainee with us. You might be better suited for developing in ballet. Well done. 
I really like it. Since Teacher Shen doesn't want her from now on, she'll be under my guidance. What's the identity of this Chinran? Movie Star G has never trained newcomers before. So, when there's no pain relief, it can be this painful. Originally, it was just a spontaneous decision to come and see. Just now, I got a notification from Julie about something else. So I won't disturb you too much today. You're leaving already? Your name is Chin Ran, right? Since I just said, I'll personally take care of her. I'll take her with me for now. Let's go. Thank you, Teacher G. Your name is Chin Ran, right? Chin Ran? President Lee, interview room is over there. We're almost there. Great. Lead the way. It's probably just an illusion. If it really is Chao Ran, why would Huai Chuan hide it from me? Chin Ran, are you okay? I'm fine. Thanks for your concern, Mr. Z. You don't look too well. Are you feeling unwell? Do you want some hot water? This cup is new. I haven't used it yet. Are you feeling unwell? Do you want some hot water? This cup is new. I haven't used it yet. I'm sorry about that. I need to take a call. Chao Ran, tonight at 7 o'clock, there will be no one in the CEO's office. The documents will be in the lounge inside. As for where the lounge is, you probably don't need me to tell you. After all, I've heard that SR was designed by you. So Chen, you're here! Do you have the contestants' information? Give me a copy to look at. Is there one missing? There's someone named Chin Ran who passed the interview and has already left. She left? Do you know her? I just noticed the one person is missing, just asking for casual. It couldn't possibly be her. If she was still alive, she'd want to kill me for sure. Why would she come here to be a traitor? So Chen, why are you still holding on to this junk? I thought you'd want to review it later. Since it's junk, you can just throw it away. Why do you always think about me and everything? I really love you, honey. Wait. Didn't you hurt your foot this morning? I'll have the driver drive you back later. I have some work at the company tonight. I won't have dinner with you. Go to bed early. Be good. Well then please drive slowly tonight. Stay safe. Speed up the progress on the Shen's family map and also go to SR and get information on a trainee named Chin Ran. Check her background. President Lee, regarding Shen's family matter, is progressing smoothly at the moment. As for the Chin Ran you mentioned, I couldn't retrieve her detailed information. What's going on? Sorry, President Lee, I arrived a bit late. Ji Huai Chuan, that movie star Ji, has already taken Chin Ran's information with him. According to SR, they said Chin Ran performed excellently today. Mr. G really likes her. He plans to personally train this newcomer. So he temporarily took her information. Chin Ran. Chao Ran. Ji Huai Chuan. Call Ji Hai Chuan and have him send Chin Ran's information over immediately. Don't say it's from me. Chao Ran. Will it be you? Oh, the archives.
everything you want. I'll make it happen for you. Don't go. Don't leave. I'm begging you. Now that you're married to me, you're mine. Shen Yesheng, I'm not Shen Keiyuan. Ran Ran. Don't go, Ran. Hold back. Shen Yesheng, you're no good at medicine. Didn't you say I'm almost done? You deserve it. I guess you just don't hurt enough. Didn't I tell you? Relationships, I've taken care of for you. The interview is just a fool's errand. Look at the state of your body. And you're trying to do ballet. Stop it. I've had it bad enough. Shen Yesheng. I... How long will I live? Don't lie to me. I know my own body. At least four more months. Yeah. It's taking a little longer than I thought. But according to your the tossed approach, I'm afraid it's not even a month. I say you've got it, so you've got it. All right. Don't try to comfort me. I know your new drug has failed. Shen Yesheng. If he finds out I'm alive, what kind of face would he make? You want to see him? Anyway, I only have four months left. That's something. We're gonna have to speed things up. What's Mr. Lee's orders? Chao Ran is still alive. Check last night's surveillance. And that is Chao Ran. It must be her. She's back. Yes, sir. Wait, wait. This handkerchief. Why does she have it? Don't be afraid, I've already called one too well. I'm gonna get you out of here. Young master, you're not completely healed. Should we take another month? No, I don't think so. Okay, I think that's the school. The school transfer has been completed. Okay, the rest, I'll be fine on my own. This is your handkerchief, isn't it? What are you doing? Roll. Is this yours? Uh-huh. You saved me that night. Uh-huh. I'll be watching over you from now on. Not again. Let anyone bully you. What's your name? Shen Keiyan. This handkerchief, I remember it was a style of anniversary limited edition. The light blue color is special, only for business partners who have cooperated with us. And the ways to buy this handkerchief are limited. Only the top VIPs can get. Chow's family in the past, it does qualify. The Shen family in the past, that handkerchief of Shen Ke Yuan's. No. It can't be her. Her handkerchief was destroyed long ago. This photo was clearly taken after I started school. 
Fu Yang, look up sales records of this handkerchief from back in the day. Check it now. I want it right away. Mr. Lee, I want it now. Okay, I'll have someone pull the list. Sichuan, look! I hear it's all the rage these days, tying handkerchiefs into your hair. Do you think it looks good? This handkerchief, it's my favorite. The most precious one of all. It just bought from your Lee group. I remember when it was designed with the idea of eternal love. Where did you get this handkerchief? I've always had it. Chao Ran? I don't care what you heard of from other people. I don't care how much energy it takes to get this handkerchief. You're not Shun Kuyuan. No matter what you do, you're not her. Say something about eternal love. People like you don't even deserve it. So it's really her? Get me a handkerchief. So Chen, you're back. Sorry, Kieran. It's still a company thing. It's okay, you're busy. The company's business is the most important. Results and Joran? I've got it. Also, putting out all the nails that the Shen family arrange in Li's. Listen in and Shen K you in. I want to know her every move. What's going on with you and Shishen? What's going on? Li's has recently been secretly suppressing the Shen family, trying to take back the Charles family properties. Huh? I was pretending to be him about the man who saved my life. He probably found out. How could that be? What's going on here? Can you in? Take advantage of the fact that Lisa Chen has not taken big moves yet. Drag him. Trying to get pregnant with his baby. No matter what he suspects, it doesn't matter. Actually, it doesn't have to be his child. After all, except for us, who else would know? Mr. Lee, who loves his wife as much as his life, never touched you. As long as he's dead, the baby in my belly will be the heir to the Knight family. Since he's no longer for me, then let's get rid of him. Lee Group will be mine after all. Charm, I knew you weren't dead. I'm sorry, Mr. Lee. You've got the wrong person. I am Tin Ran. Don't lie to me again. Ran. I really miss you. I really don't understand, Mr. Lee. What are you talking about? You and Mrs. Shen are so in love. Why are you holding me back in public? I'm just a little trainee. Charan, Lisa Chen, what are you doing to my people? Your people? Ji Huai Chuan, you know she's Charan. Why didn't you tell me? Let go. Chen Ran is from a remote mountainous region. She looks just like Charan. I knew her two years ago. She's not Charan, but the photo on the file is clear not her. Why would Mr. Lee even think of looking at the trainee's profile? That's a mistake, I noticed it last time. I've spoken to the archives. Lisa Chen, you'd better come to your senses. Chao Ran has been killed by you. Wait for me in my office. Julie's still there waiting for you. You saw it. I've got work to do here. Not today. We'll talk about it another time. Come with me. Sit here. Wai Chan is still busy. Feel free to eat the snacks on the table. I have to go. This door doesn't need to be closed. Wai Chan, you know I do like you. I've been going to school since I've always liked you. Wai Chan, you know I like you. Since we've been in school, I've always liked you. Mrs. Shen, please respect yourself. Wai Chan, why are you doing this, always rejecting me? Why can't you look at me more? Suppressing my resources? Getting people to spread rumors that I like you? Mr. Shen's love, I really can't afford. I made all of these, so what? 
I only did it because I love you too much. As long as you're with me, I can give you all of this. In the school, you're friendly to the other people. Why only you don't like me? Is it because of Si Chen? Well, I'm marrying Si Chen, using him to move up the ladder, but in front of me, saying you love me. Don't you think you're disgusting? Don't you think are you being cruel to me? Not even a smile you never have shown to me. I've been cruel to you. It's not the way it should be. You're a profit-oriented person all my life. I can't possibly like you. How can you think of me like that? Don't think what you did. No one will ever know. The reason why Lisa Chen like you so much isn't because you took someone else's place. Let him mistake you as a savior. Remember what he hated the most? That's deception. Taking someone else's place? Savior? Deception? What does Si Hai Chuan mean by that? I don't understand what you're saying. The reason for his protecting you and liking you? All because he was in a car accident. Yeah. The girl saved him. But that identity, you claimed it. Oh yeah. Also the overseas offer of the ballet company, your so-called talented dancer, gimmick. Shun Kuen. Which one of these didn't you steal them from her? So the boy who was there? It was Lisa Chen? So, if Mr. Shen continued to harass me again, the context of the conversation just now, I'm gonna find Shishin and have a good chat. You- It turns out that between us there is hope for happiness. Puyang, I want the Shen family to disappear from the capital. I want Shen Kuyuan's reputation destroyed. Ji Huai Chuan, looks like we have a lot to talk about. Heard it all? I'm sorry, I really didn't mean to eavesdrop. Julie asked me to wait for you here. I see. You don't remember anything about me, Charan? You're not remembering correctly, are you? My name is Tian Ran. Ran Ran. All my life, I'll never mistake you for anyone else. Your brother Huai Chuan. Finally. I'm sorry I left because of my father's transformation, so I had to transfer out of the city. I failed to protect you. So you did it on purpose? Did you get all the evidence on tape? That's smart. It's worth it. So much effort to investigate. But how it's done, will it get you into trouble? Actually, I saw it yesterday. I looked it up after you and found out that you're going here through Shen Jian Shen. Our families have been friends for generations. That's why you're sick. I've got it all figured out. That's my business. Will he, Lisa Chen? Don't worry. The flaws in your file? I've taken care of all of them for you. It won't be found. I'll take Ki Yuan here today. On the one hand, it's to help you gather evidence. On the other hand, it's also to let you know the whole truth about what happened back then. What you guys just said, I heard everything. But Brother Hai Chuan, I really don't get it. Who he really loves. Ran Ran, in fact, all these years, Lisa Chen, I've only loved you since the beginning. You said it's because of Shi Ke Yuan has taken advantage of my saving his life. But after all these years, his favor and fondness of her, all of this is real. In the years since we married, I tried my best. I want him to like me, but I still haven't done it. In fact, all these years, about the relationship, he's had his doubts. But he always believed the first time you saw each other, his throbbing is the evidence. So keep hinting that he loved her. These are things that happen over time. Everyone takes it seriously, including himself. I don't believe you. What's the point? Ran Ran, you're still in love with him, aren't you? I don't know. I just know because of this ridiculous love killed my father, my children, and myself. Uncle's death is actually nothing to do with Lee Sin Chen. It's all about the Shen family, behind the scenes. What? You don't need to feel any pressure. I'm telling you this. Just don't want you to regret it. Whatever you want to do in the end, I'll always be behind you. I'm with you. All the forces in the G family. You'll be able to mobilize all of them. Thank you, Mr. Hui Chen. But about him... I still need some time. Think about it. Ran Ran. I'm sorry for all these years. No, I don't want anything else. I just want the rest of my life to be happy. Ji Hai Chuan. I thought our purpose is the same thing. I'll get you to help me deal with Lisa Chen. I'm not asking you to cause trouble. Ran Ran, she only has four months left now. 
I just don't want to her to have regrets. Unexplained departure. The movie star is really something. Words. Just put yourself in the image. Such a great honor. In reality, it's just a guy who's running away. A coward. You think no one will ever know your little mind? Whatever you say. That's not a lot of bullshit, Ji Huai Chuan. You can only coax him. Chow Ran. That stupid girl. If you knew that his good brother, in fact, he secretly loved her for years, wouldn't that be touching? Shen Yan Shen. Take care of yourself. The others, I advise you to mind your own business. You've been from the beginning, know the whole story, and persuade Lisa Chen, hold fast to his love for Shen Kuan. As long as these misunderstandings remain unresolved, one day, Chao Ran's love will wear thin. That time, we've got an opportunity. Right? Shut up. I'm not finished. Why are you so angry? Think about it. If I die, Charan won't live long. What the hell are you doing? When you hear the news of Charan's marriage, you can't bear it. You fled the country immediately. Now why are you come back to interview me? Wouldn't it be nice to keep it in your stomach? Why do you have to say it? Come out and shake her. Shen Yan Shan. You're in love with her. Does it matter to you? You're just a guy who's destined to be out of the game. But I want Chao Ran hate you for the rest of life. Don't say and do unnecessary things. Shen Yan Shan. Shen Yan Shan. Don't be angry. You're a public figure. It's not good to be recognized. Chief Wai Chuan. Now that you've admitted the Brotherhood just use a lifetime of acting the part, just keep on. Don't let her see your dirty inside. Shen Yan Shen. You think you're still the young master of the Shen family? From the time you gave up the Shen family and chose to be a doctor? You're gone. You're in no position to warn me. Oh. Well, we'll see. After Ms. Shen left SR, she went to the city hospital for a medical checkup and saw Shen Shi Chen. After that, she went back to her home. She never came out again. I got it. It's getting late. You should get off too. There's a birthday party at Zhao's house the day after tomorrow. We'll put the recording. We're going to release it in public. Shen Qiyuan's subsequent blackmail. Have you contacted the media? Don't worry, Mr. Li. I'll give you a ride today. Shen Yansheng, I just learned that today. My father didn't actually kill by him. There's been a lot of misunderstanding between us. I want to talk to him. So what if it's not Mr. Lee? It's not him? Chao family and you wouldn't have come to this. You said Lisa Chen didn't kill your father. What about your four children? What are they? I haven't forgiven him. I just, I wanted to find him and ask him something. Even if I suddenly dies one day, I'll be able to die in a clearer way. Chara, what are you telling me? You still love him? Two days, there's a birthday party at Zhao's house. He'll be there. I'll get you a ticket. That's it. You remember to send me a copy of Shen Kuyuan evidence, including today's recording. How do you know everything? You've got such a brain. Still trying to get revenge? Grab all the resources of Ji Huai Chuan and mention the Ji family again. Aren't you related to the Z family? We've told you before on the usual, we can take care of them. When? It's your turn to talk. I can't stand the sight of him, can I? Just do it. Don't blow my cover. Fu Yang. Fu Yang.
Is there a car accident over there? Yeah, it's that bad. Call 120. Call it now. Call, call it, it now. now. Look at the car. Call it now. Look at that car. Get out of here. I want to be alone with him. Remember that no one is allowed to reveal his condition. And about the special assistant, Fu, of course, would be very bad for the group. What about tomorrow's shareholders meeting? Don't panic. Tomorrow, I'll invite my father. Go run the show for a while. Tell Sachin that he's sick for two days. Don't worry. I've already asked the doctor. He's only here because of blood clot in his brain, causing a small portion of memory damage. You'll get it back soon enough. Yes, ma'am. What about Mr. Fu's funeral? Just notify his parents. After all, he is Si Chen, his most trusted man. We need to stabilize the minds of the people. Inside the group, let's just say it's Mr. Fu temporarily transferred to work overseas. It's been a busy night. It's almost dawn. You go back to rest, too. How do that people you hire do it? People can be killed by mistake? Now that his close associates get defensive, it's gonna be hard to do anything else. His driver's not here. Doesn't he always drive himself from work? I didn't think there'd be an accident. Now, Lisa Chen, what's going on over there? But it can be seen a blessing in disguise. Lisa Chen, his memory is confused. It's in the story of his consciousness, except that I saved him that year. And then we were happy until married with a beautiful family. I'm even pregnant with his child. There's no such thing as Tiao Run. Well, that's good. That's good. Oh, yeah. I already told the assistant. Night shareholders meeting is tomorrow. You're going to the meeting. It just so happens that Fu Yang is dead now. Take advantage of this. We must seize the opportunity. Catch Lee's. Nothing can go wrong. Shenyang Xiang, the G family, is it you did this? If you later still want to see the G family in the Imperial capital, let go of me now. <laughs> this time it's just a warning. Ji Hai Chuan, what we talked about last time, you better remember that. Put yourself in your place. Stay away from Chao Ran. Well, don't blame me. I don't miss all these years of love. Shen Yan Shen, you're a madman. So what? If you're not feeling up to it, it's okay. I'll give you a chance to compete. With this opportunity, you're going to have to trade the entire G for it. Will you do it? I'm talking to Mr. G. What's your attitude? Since you can't do it, get your ass back here. To your gutter. Stay out of my way. The party's about to begin. Do you get an invitation? Patience. Brother Hui Chen, what brings you here? This is your invitation. Take this with you. O okay. The Zhao family invited me to be guest of honor. You as my date. Go in with me. Remember what I said. Brother Hui Chen, what are you talking about? It's about me taking care of you. Don't worry, I'll figure it out later. Make it happen. Leave you alone with him. Okay. Find a chance to give Hui Chen some trouble. Make a fool out of him. Chao Ran. 
Louis Chowder. How could I? Just remember the name. Si Chen, headache again? Don't worry, I'm fine. Oh, do you know a guy named Chow Ran? Why are you asking about her all of a sudden? What do you memorize? It's in my head. Suddenly a name flashed. Let me ask you something. I don't like your talking about her. She liked you for years. And she's always stirring up trouble between us, setting me up in front of you, tarnish my image. She even threatened you with suicide by jumping into the sea, interfering in our marriage. She, she is that person. Of course she is. And she drugged you by any means necessary to be pregnant with your child. Make us part. Luckily, she lost a baby in the end. But it's always a knot in my heart. So I'm really, you never talk about her. And I don't want you to have any more contact with her. So that's it? Honey, don't be mad. I was just asking. You know, I've never loved anyone but you. Why Chuan? First time with a female companion attending an event. No introductions? This is my lover, a little... Lover? When do you have a question? How could you like someone else? Why does Miss Shen care so much? My love life? I remember my contract without such contents. You're in show business. Also a good friend of the Chen's. I'm always supposed to have more caring concern. How do you talk to your sister-in-law? Honey, you're not feeling well. Just leave him alone. It's still a matter of the company. You don't have to worry about everything. Your wife is pregnant? Yes, but not for long. No one said a word before it's stable. Hi, Chen. Do you want more preparing for the opening program? You don't have to stay here with me all the time. I'll be fine on my own. You go now. Sir Chen, can you help me bring her to the upstairs lounge? She handed it over to someone else. I'm not sure. Okay. That's right, Mr. Shen. I'll make a public clarification for our rooms. Save from getting in the way of your conversation, Mr. Lee's feelings. Also avoid my lover's misunderstanding. Javi, I suddenly remembered there's something else going on at the office. I forgot to give it to Monica. You go upstairs first. All right, then. Don't tire yourself out. I'll wait for you in the lounge. I haven't asked the lady. What's your name? Chowra. Chowra? How do you see the damn man didn't die? So you're disappointed? Lisa Chen, from my jumping, how long has it been? And you're marrying Shen Ke Yuan. You even had a child. You guys can't wait. This is ridiculous. Ke Yuan and I have been in love for many years. Do you think this relationship jumped into the sea? Can you change that? You just said you love her? If I didn't love her, I'd love you. But she's a thief. Lisa Chen, all of this, she stole it. Stole it from me. When you were in a car accident, the man who saved your life, it's me. A ballet genius from childhood. She stole the name. She fakes everything. Why do you believe her? Chao Ram, I'm warning you not to, in my face, falsely accuse my beloved. Otherwise, even if you now have attracted Huai Chuan, I'll never forgive you either. Lisa Chen, are you blind? She's obviously faking everything. Even her feelings are also fake. The one she really loves is Si Hui Chuan. Why do you only believe in her? A man who doesn't dare to live with real identity? You need to wear a mask to attend the banquet? Your words. Do you think I'll believe it? Besides, you've already got Hui Chuan. Now you have to come running past the lead? Chow Ran. People like you are really cheap. I've become like this. It's all because of you. Lisa Chen, you owe me. You'll never be able to pay me back. It's pretty pathetic. So my father's death, did you have anything to do with it? Lisa Chen, even this pot you're going to take the fall for her, aren't you? Chow Ram, now that you've met with Ji Huai Chuan, in the future, please don't interrupt my married life. Lisa Chen, then my father and my child, how will you pay for their lives? It's not all you. You're to blame.
Lisa Chen, I really regret this. I regret meeting you. I regret falling in love with you. Miss, are you okay? Would you like a glass of water? Thank you, sir. Excuse me, ma'am. I got you wet. I'm sorry. It's okay. You can leave now. I'll go get you a new one. Okay, okay. Miss, would you like to wear this dress? Do you see the one next to the movie star? The girl in the white dress getting her clothes dirty? Then try to get her to change into... This one. Don't ask questions you shouldn't know. Don't worry. She won't see there's something wrong with that. There's $30,000 on this card. As long as you do this, this card is yours. Don't worry about it. I'll make it happen. What's going on? I'm fine. You guys doing okay? Don't worry, Mr. Hui Chuan. Actually, from the very beginning, I didn't have much hope. People like him, how can he be soft on me? What did he tell you? He said I was cheap. He says it's all just I'm to blame. Never want to see me again. Says he loves Shen Ke Yuan, even for her sake. He willingly took my father's death on himself. What's going on? It's okay. You can cry if you want to. I'll cover for you. Who is the Hui Chuan hugging? Who is the Hui Chuan hugging? This is the scoop. Why is there a reporter? Mr. Hui Chuan, did I give it to you for trouble? Run around. You must remember. You never will be. My trouble. How'd it go? Don't worry, Mr. Shen. Ki Yuan. What are you doing here? I've been looking for you for a long time. I didn't go out because I thought the show was about to start. Are you staying with Lover of Hui Chua? Why coming here? I feel sick just thinking about her. It's been with Hui Chuan. Knowing full well that you and I are in love and marriage. I can't believe she had the nerve to come to me. It's Chao Ran. It's just like you said. It's just like you said she told you she was Chao Ran? I know you don't want me to talk about her. Now I know who she is. I'll avoid her from now on. And you don't be mad. You're still pregnant. Amber is bad for you and the baby. It's not good. Don't worry, I'm not angry. Oh! Shun Ke Yuan. You drew the heat. Let's leave it up to you. Go. Stop the recording. Why, Chuan, you know me. I like you. I've been in love with you since I was in school. I've always liked you. I made these. But so what? It's only because I love you too much. As long as you're with me. <laughs> is it true about Mr. Lee? Sujin is not true, believe me. I didn't say any of those things. It must be a synthesis. Someone must be trying to set me up. You're my wife. Of course I believe you. Sujin, help me. These recordings can't get out. You know that. The fans can't tell black and white at all. Once it's out there, my career is over! Don't worry, I'm here. I won't let anything happen to you. You go ahead of me. I'll take care of this. Oh yeah? Send someone to fence the area. Mr. Lee, Mr. Fu is not here. Why do I have to move him overseas at this time? Take the reporter's hand clean. Can't be released. Then find out who's behind it. Miss Fu, you like me just now? How long has it been? She's already committed to Ji Hai Chuan. Xiao Ran, you bitch! When you first hooked up with Lisa Twin, I'm done. And now you dare to put your hand on Hui Chuan? Isn't she dead? Yeah, she's dead. Why can't you just crawl under the ground? You had to come to get me killed. 
Then I'll make it happen. Monica, come here. The assistant hasn't been answering my calls. Roman, can you wait for me here? I'm gonna go get my car. I'll be right back. Brother, I'm really okay. You don't have to worry about me. I'll be right here. Okay, okay, okay. Ron, are you okay? Lisa Chen, why? Why did you save me? Ron. I know I made these. Can't cancel it out of a mistake I made earlier, but now I seem to pay for it with our lives. I seem to have to pay for it with our lives. Don't say it, don't say it! Ambulance, call an ambulance! Don't cry. This life, I owe you so much. The rest, I'll pay back in my next life. Don't let him go, don't sleep, I don't agree. You stay alive. Where's Shen Yesheng? Call him. He should still be around. I'm sure he'll be able to cure you. Shen Yesheng, save him. You must be able to save him. Ran, he's your enemy. Are you sure you want me to save him? As long as we don't do anything, three more minutes. There's nothing he can do. That's the perfect time to kill him and not have to take the rap for it. Save him. Ask me to save him? There's a price to pay. He's got the money. Chao Ran, I'm not talking that kind of price. What do you want? I want you. Am I not yours? Yeah. You're mine. Don't worry, I'm here. You won't die. Chow Ran! Take a trip through Ghost Gate? You're still in good spirits? I'm still alive? Where's Chow Ran? She's in therapy. Healing? She's hurt? Mr. Lee's forgetfulness? That's pretty big. Still, do you still think that the organ failure is lying to you? After all, the image of me in some people's minds is ingrained. Charon isn't... listen to me. I can't afford it. It's a big gift from Mr. Lee. I'm here to ask for an answer. Why did you say me that day? After all, you and Shen Ke Yun have been in love for years. And I'm the one who set up your lover twice. A lowlife. An unscrupulous woman. No? Charan, let me explain. Explain? Explain what? You're going to humiliate me again, aren't you? I was in a car accident a while back. I mistook Shun Kuyuan for you. That's why I thought I love her. Car crash? Looks like you're not going to have a nice little chat. Lisa Chen, listen to your own excuses. How outrageous! Fu Yang's dead. What? Just a little while ago, I was in a car accident. Fu Yang saved my life. But, uh, I forgot all about it. Shin Kuyuan's lying to me. That Fu Yang was transferred to a foreign country by me? I can't believe I believed that. I'm sorry for your loss. You believe now what I said? Ran. Brother, let him finish. Whatever. He saved my life yesterday. 
Ran, when you jump off a cliff, I realised that later. I've been in love with you for a long time. And then I even found out, saved me, and made me fall in love at first sight. That girl was you too. But at that time, Shun Kuyuan fooled me with a handkerchief. So actually from the beginning to end, I'm falling in love over and over again. It's always just been you. What about Shun Kuyuan's child? It was before your accident. It was there. That was before your accident. It was there. That's not my baby. What? I don't know. I never touched her. I found out it was her and Shun Sichun killed your father, took away the Chao family, and he's the one who made us all these years of missing out. So? I would have made her a fool of herself. Take what belongs to the Chao's. After we get it all back, I'll put him in jail. And then kill myself. Go down and stay with you. I didn't expect it. She's the one who made the first move. Didn't you just wake up? How do you know she did all this? It's actually pretty easy to guess. She's too ambitious. I used to think of her as you, so I indulged her. Now she knows. I'm aware of it. There's got to be something. So this time, wouldn't your company be- Don't worry about it. The ones I keep, none of them are easy. Shun Sichang has been around for years. It seems to have penetrated a lot. But the core of Lee's apartment, he's never touched it. They say Shun Sichang is an old fox. I think you are the most cunning of them all. Chao Ran. But if this person is you, even if you want Lee's in my hands, all the shares are willing to do the same. Lee Sichang, where did you get that face? Saying such things to her. If it wasn't for you, her body wouldn't have- Enough! Li Chen. you saved my life yesterday. I'll take that as a favor. All these years, the things you've done to the Tao family? As for choosing to marry you, and again, you've put yourself tossed to this. I'm to blame. In the future- Let's go back to the bridge on the road. Life and death are not related. Let's go. They'll be out soon. I'm tired, Brother Huichuan. Let's go. Just in the hospital, I've heard everything I need to hear. That's what you think. The man in the palm of your hand, Shun Kuyuan. You've been counting for so long, and in the end, it's still a joke. So, how do you want to cooperate? Who said anything about working with you? I'm just an ordinary doctor. Dr. Shin suddenly called me over. It won't be simple to let me listen to these. Uh-huh. Dylan. Oh. It seems that you are not. How do you know my identity? Last night at the banquet after Knight's desperate attempts to stop, it allows the message to go out in the first place. Make the online outpouring the black stuff I grew up with just hammer me to death. A chance to argue, not even for me. So sudden, such a big move. How can that be leave no trace? You think you can threaten me? It's not a threat. I am now a street rat. Everyone's got to be punished. Shen Sicheng and I have broken off our relationship to save himself. Li Sicheng, suddenly the memory returns. The child bargaining chip also nullified. Wait till he's out of the hospital. It's on me. It's really going in. So? What does it have to do with me? So, yeah, I am now it's one of the best weapons in the world. It's a vicious weapon that doesn't have a back door. You want Xiaoran. And I, I want a way out. This way, I think... This city should only have one who stayed behind the scenes. The mysterious Dylan. It's the only one can afford. That's crazy. But it's also a madman you can take apart. You said, help me get Chowran? But she's mine. Her heart. Is it yours too? 
Just in time. The man in her heart and the one I'm trying to get rid of. It's the same one. As long as he's dead. Dr. Shin has a beautiful woman in his arms. I can do with this bastard will inherit the knights. All the world knows anyway. He loves me so much. What's the truth behind this? And where did this child come from? Is it so important? I can give you some resources. As far as how to do it, it's up to you. Things are going well. I'll let you live if you can't do it. Dr. Sh Lisa Chen has found you. The location of your lab in the Imperial City. We've sent a team looking for a girl. Pack all of Chao Ran's clothes up. Take it to the Villa Bala River. Okay. The lab isn't alright? What's wrong with you brought me to your house? Lots of hospital programs these days. I'm out of ideas. Every day exclusively to see you in the lab, don't worry. I've got all that equipment at home. It won't delay your treatment. All right, then. Your room. It's on the second floor. First room on the left. Don't go anywhere else. And don't move. Familiarize yourself. I'll cook first. Got it. What's going on like a mom? Chow Ren. Do you think I'm not good with my ears? You still love him. Who? Except for Lisa Chen. Who else can make you like this? Is it important? I don't have much time left. Me and him and never again. No more. Yes, Chao Ran. You better be telling the truth. Shen Yanshan, I don't want to in the last days carry my hatred with me. He risked his life to save me once. I'll consider it paid off. All these years of debt. All these years of debt? But your medicine has already failed. Shen Yansheng, do you like me? Overthinking it. You're just my research subject. Why do you care so much about me and Lisa Chen? I just don't want, because of what's going on with you guys, interrupting my research. Interfering with my data. Charan, you have to remember, you're all I have. Yes? Let's just say I'm overthinking it. Upstairs room. I like it. It's random. Just like that. Hey? Ran Ran, we... can I see you again? Ran, I don't ask you to forgive me. I just want to ask you if you can. Give me one more chance. Let's start over. This time, just stay where you are. It's my turn to find you. Your hot milk. Just the right temperature. Thank you, sir. You want me to get rid of it? No need. I'll take care of it myself. Drink the milk while it's hot. It's not hot anymore. Lisa Chen, stop pushing me. I am now, I just want to get on. The few time, I'd like to start with the one who'd been stuck with me for six years in a cage named Lisa Chen. Escape. As for you, forget about me. Charan. Okay. I respect you. I have some more here. You and Uncle, what's left behind? I'll see you tomorrow. I'll wait for you at home. After that, I'll leave you alone. Okay. It's a bit of an eyesore. I have limited patience. Time for you. Not a lot. Why are you so beautiful today? I don't have many days left anyway. 
Later, I'm going to live each day to the fullest. This week, I'm going to do a little identity restoration, then go abroad and have some fun. Dr. Shen, I don't think so. You will be reasonable, right? I'm a poor dying man. It's okay. What about today? We have an appointment. Uh, a moment. Going to see an old friend. Okay. Come back early, Chara. Chara? You're mine. It's mine! Lisa Chen, wake up! It's finally here. Shen Kuyan, what are you doing? What am I doing? Of course, I want you to die. We have no quarrel. Why are you doing this to me? No quarrel. If there is no you, I would have logically become Mrs. Lee, the envy of all. The superstar of the entertainment industry instead of being reduced to where now. But those don't belong to you at all. You know that because you lied. How much I paid for it. Everyone has a life. It's your fate. What's it got to do with me? As long as you're dead, I'll be able to go along for the ride. Leaning on my children, inheriting the Lees. Let her go. Mr. Lee, you'd better think about your own condition. Tonight's headline, I've got it all figured out for you. President Lee, taking a lover during Mrs. Lee's pregnancy, was burned to death in his home. <laughs> Mrs. Lee took care of the aftermath with tears in her eyes. Declare will take care of Lee's business temporarily, helping to hold down the family business. What you thought about your children? Am I the only one who knows? What do you mean? I'm Lisa Chen. You think? I only have one hand to prepare. Now release us. I can still give you a chance to live. It doesn't matter. Just kill you. I'll live. As long as you die. As long as you're dead. Who are you counting on to save you? Dylan? How do you know it's him? Shen Yesheng? Who let you touch her? No, it's not, Dr. Shen. Let me explain. The only person I want to kill is Lisa Chen. I have no idea she's coming today. Yes? How did I hear you say you'd have to wait for Rang to get here and burn us all together? This isn't all Dr. Shen's asking made me do it? So you'll be the last to be a hero to save the day. Why are we done now? Dr. Shen is denying it again? Shen Ye Sheng? Drag her down. Ram, don't listen to her. I didn't. I didn't. She's setting me up. Is that right? Without Mr. Shen's help, just by being her now, how could she do all this? Right? Dylan? I don't know, Mr. L is talking about... What are you talking about? Who's Dylan again? I'm just an ordinary doctor. I was skeptical before you came. So I swindled Shen Kuyuan. Combine them again, between your conversation and reaction, it's not hard to guess the man behind her is you. Dylan, Ran Ran, it's getting late. It's time for us to go home. So this is all a setup? Shen Yesheng, why? Because you're mine! Take Miss Chow back. No, Shen Yesheng! Before it's all said and done, I'm not going back with you! I'm here. Don't you dare take her away from me. Lisa Chen, are you sure you want to stop me? There's no me. Chow Ran won't last a month. She'll be dead. And then you'll be Charan's murderer. Think clearly. You're going to get her killed again? Shen Yan Shan, I don't understand. Why are you doing this to me? 
There's so much hostility. You probably don't. Before your mother gave birth to you, she's out there and there's a bastard. That's me. For the Lees, for the sake of his mansion wife, leaving me all alone. Even tried to strangle me, to eliminate the danger. You tell me why I don't hate you. Zhang Yansheng, let go of me. Zhang Yansheng, as for Shen Ken Yuan, this mess, I'll leave it to Mr. Li. Take care of it yourself. Chao Ran, I'm going to get it. Shen Yansheng, you asshole! Look at that spirit. You wake up and you're ready to curse? Untie me! The length of this chain. Enough to get you to the bathroom. I'll do it every day from now on. It's going to work. Shen Yansheng, you promised me. At the end of the day, it's for me to travel. Your organs? It stopped failing now. Chao Ran, I told you I wouldn't let you die. I don't have to die? I'm still alive? Go away! Let go of me! Shen Yansheng, you have no right to lock me up. You have no idea about what is love, what is like. Shen Yansheng, I asked you. Do you like me? You said I'm just your research subject. The experiment has now succeeded. Your research subject is not working anymore. Why are you locking me up again? You're mine. You're mine. I saved your life. Ran Ran. You're crazy, Shen Yansheng. You're a doctor. As long as you don't live, I can give you anything you want. I want you to fuck off. I want you out of my sight. The body that was so hard to heal, you can't live without eating. What are you doing here? I don't come. Some people starve to death. If you're here to help him as a lobbyist, then I'll have to ask you to leave. Ran, do you know how long you've been on hunger strike in your room? Shen Yan Shen also starts outside. After Lisa Chen learned that your news, two families in business are fighting to the death. Brother Hui Chen, that's not what I want. Why do you think I'll meet them in life? Actually, I just want to be like everyone else, having a simple life. After Sun Shi Chang's bankruptcy, something was wrong with the spirit. Lisa Chen sent him to an insane asylum. Chao's family owned all the businesses in the first place. They are all back to the way it used to be. Is there any point in talking about this now? The one who expects most Chao's prospering, already dead. Shen Kuyuan is in jail. After a few of us combined pressure, I think she's been in prison her whole life. It should be a wonderful life. But Brother Huai Chuan, what do you think I look like now? With her in prison, what's the difference? Don't be afraid, Ran. You still have me. I heard Shen Yan Sheng say, you want to go abroad? If you want to go, then go. Anyway, no. You've got a lot of time on your hand. That... can he eat now? This porridge is made by the man. Hey, what do you care? The kid deserves to be punished for his mistakes. When you've had your fill, I'll take you away, you stinking man. Don't move! Robbery! Take all you have on you. Empty your pockets. Don't hurt me. I'll give you the money. Don't hurt me. Lisa Chen. Don't be afraid. I'm here. Lisa Chen, I'm really okay. There's really no need to be hospitalized. Will you leave me alone? Just listen to me. Let's just observe for a day. I know you still don't want to see me. You get well, I'm gonna disappear. Hi, there's a gentleman here. Let me hand you this. It turns out he's there.